even in normal times, people, lots of people feel lonely. And it's not easy to, to guide people or suggest things because I think most people find the thought of doing something a little different difficult. It's not the actual doing they find hard, it's the thought of it. But I would always say for people who are not used to um, making contact with other people or going out, you have to take baby, baby steps. And one of these, even those who, who don't have great mobilization, there is always something going on in nature and in the streets, always. Nothing is static. So this is what I would suggest to people who are not used to it, just to, to look at anything around them. You can take pictures of them. Everybody has a, a smartphone, or most people do. I've been to some amazing places that I, I didn't even know where they were before, you know? So these are great opportunities uh, right now in this, in this lockdown period. See all this amazing stuff you've never seen before. <laughs> and I've done lots of that, and I, that's a favorite for me. Instead of fast walking like you may have done before, like slow it down and take the time to really look at things and really study a plant that's over, the, over your pathway, really look at it and a branch, instead of flicking it away, you know, take hold of it and, and look at it and look at the, what's on it. They're always interesting, always. It's exploring, it's all about exploring. Walking, doing walks and properly exploring. Everything's slowed down, so the pace is much better. I would say, for older people.